All right, who's ready for a motherfucking tournament arc? Let's go! All right. Huh? Are you interested in the tournament? The best in the underground tournament is the festival to decide the number one puppeteers in the whole underground. Of course, we have a prize for the champion. We're accepting unofficial participants, too. Hey, you want to join? Yep, absolutely. That's the spirit. The games will be starting shortly. So, uh... Rare for the underground. The next challenger is a human. What kind of tricks are up the challenger's sleeves? I, I believe, if I recall correctly, we're going to fight Yugi at some point here, and even a super secret character uh, that is surprising. How unfortunate for you to be matched with me. Prepare your butt, butt for a swift whooping? <laughs> what are you, fucking 90? It's Smofy! Smofy! Fucking, fucking Smofy! Oh, these names, dude, they're too good. I can't handle them. I'm just gonna hope... Oh, that's a problem. That's some coverage you have there, lass. Didn't do that much damage, but it is kind of problematic. Hopefully you're not part fire type. You're not. Goodbye. Uh, you're just gonna have a bunch of ghosts or some shit. No, that's not a ghost. I mean, it might be part nether, but it's not a ghost. Not necessarily. I actually have no clue what a Hashihime is. I think that's what they're called. Uh, I have no clue what their category... They might be ghosts now that I think about it. I don't know, man. You, you do seem to have a lot of ghosts. Because this is a ghost. I do know that much. Ah, man. Now that I look at Marasa, I'm just disappointed that fucking Goyoku Ibun isn't out. And will never be out. It doesn't exist. It's a complete fabrication. There's never been a game called Goyoku Ibun, and you're a fool for thinking it exists. I won't admit defeat. You may have beat me, but you've still got a long way to go. You'll end up losing sooner or later. I mean, statistically speaking, yeah, probably. Doubt it'll be in this tournament, though. Who's next? It's just a yokai. What a cute little puppeteer, but I won't let you win. The cute puppeteer is you, Torute? Isn't this supposed to be like... Torte, that's a thing. Torte is a thing, right? I don't know, Lamau. Uh, let's switch into Mioi here, even if she is just dreadfully overleveled. She's our best coverage for this. Good lord, she's so high level. How low is her goddamn cost? The answer must be very. She is constantly overleveled. But she also comes in quite frequently to just kind of shit up the uh, enemy's abilities. Her Disturber ability is just so practical for, for cases like this. Venom Fang. Oh, gross. That's a problem. Yeah, that's a bit of a... A bit of a yikes moment, as the kids would say. Probably. I don't know. I'm not a kid. Uh, extra Raina is down, though. So we will uh, carry on. Hopefully not have too much trouble against Clown Piece. Alright, you seem to be all about the fire types. I probably should not have used... Uh, probably should have used Aquasonic there. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Wow, okay, that did little damage, surprisingly. I really expected that to one-shot, but I guess you are Speed Clown Piece, not Power Clown Piece. I don't even remember if Power Clown Piece fucking exists. I'd assume so, but I don't know. She might have assist. He could be illusion type, huh? I mean, I probably have speed. Probably. I do, and you're dead. Goodbye, Kudi. Uh, right. You are dead. Confirmed. Dead confirmed. Good. Goodbye, weird disc waifu. One of those, one of those weird PC-98 designs people are always want to point out. Oh my, I lost. Good luck on the next match. We have a couple of moves that we're going to need to learn once this tournament arc is over. Ah, yes, here's the here's the surprise show up. It's Mima for some fucking reason. I don't know, I'm not gonna complain, she cute. Oh, am I fighting a human? It's been a while since I last fought a human. Aren't you the recently rumored strong human that's not Reimu? What about Marissa, man? Wasn't she, your, like, your disciple or something? I don't fucking know. I heard you've been nosing around the puppet incident. Let me see what you've got. And we actually get, uh, reincarnation, I assume? It's Banger. Uh, light type, huh? It's a bit of an awkward typing for, uh... You're like light electric, I want to say, so I guess I'll just go for armor pierce. Light javelin. That is slightly problematic, considering how much goddamn damage that did. I guess I can switch into Miwi if need be. I have no clue what your subtyping is, by the way. Evidently, it's weak to fucking steel, so get owned, nerd. Nature. Oh, wind, probably. Wind or dark, if I had to guess. Ah, uh, you're faster than me for some reason. I don't know, Mima's always struck me as slow. I have no real basis for that. Also, I was not paying any attention to what type you are, so uh, I'm just gonna put Mioi in and pray. I'm gonna pray that you're part fire type because you've got fire coverage, but that might be uh, wrong. Brave Song. Is that just a stat buff of some sort? Spread attack by two stages, yikes. That could be a problem. Uh, not if I just kill, though. That, that, that helps. 
Uh, Reimu. Reimu is probably still Void Illusion, which is still just a really fucking annoying typing, to be honest. You'd probably go for an Illusion-type attack, which means that I should switch into fucking no one, because the only things that resist Void are Steel, which is dead, and Nether, which I don't have. So, we are just going to hit Geyser and fucking pray. Uh... Actually, we should probably switch into Saki now that I think about it. You still gonna be Void Illusion? Yeah, that's an Illusion-type attack. That's gonna hurt a lot. It did hurt a decent amount. I guess it wouldn't necessar didn't necessarily hurt a lot, but I am going to switch into Saki since I do have Super Effective for, uh... For, uh, whatever. Actually, wait, no. Illusions fucking resist Stark. What an annoying goddamn typing. Is there any weaknesses to, uh... Dreamu's Void Illusion typing? Or is she, uh... She's just a real piece of shit. <laughs> There might be a, a weakness that I'm just not considering. Hopefully you have an item. I think you had an item. Yeah, you did. That explains it. <laughs> Alright, goodbye, Mima. Huh, guess I wasn't serious enough. Thought I could win. Uh, so, you want to solve the puppet incident? I think it's too fun to end it so soon. Well, I'll give you a clue for the incident as a spoil of war. Don't insist too much on a single thing. Apparently, puppets have more than one energy source. Are you intrigued? Quite intriguing, isn't it? But I won't spoil too much for you. The party's over, so I'm going back to where I should be. You, have you ever heard of Ramadan? That's like my home. We might even see each other again sometime. I'm looking forward to it. Goodbye, Mima. Uh, is that everyone? Or do we fight Yugi in the end? Uh, no, that's just a ghost. Oh no, wait, that is the end. Congratulations, that was hot. We present you this Yoma book as the prize for the champion. Alright, case book five. I should probably read these at some point. Keep on fighting, champ. So do we not fight? I thought we fought Yogi there, but clearly my memory ain't what it used to be. That's a lie. It's exactly what it used to be, which is to say fucking trash. <laughs> All right, let's heal up. I don't think we need to. We probably got healed after that, but whatever. And I need to... Who's 63? Because I need to get them some new abilities. Uh, Yorgamis and Momoyo must have been. Uh, you got Cross Counter. Gross. Absolutely disgusting. Was there another one or just, just Cross? Uh, there's this. Burn Strike. 90 base power, 10% chance to burn, lands crits more often. Less burn chance, more power, good crit chance. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine then. And what about good Momoyo? Nope, not that. You. Hachiman's Blessing is focus energy. Cross counter is bad. Get out of my face, Momoyo. Learn a good skill for once in your fucking life, would ya? I wonder. Can I go get Steel Javelin and maybe teach that to, um... What's her fucking name? Uh... Mayumi, that's her name. Is is that something she can get? Do you even have Steel Javelin? You fucking don't. Why, though? Alright, never mind. Later, nerd. Guess there's no skill called Steel Javelin. I thought there was a Javelin for every skill, but I must be incorrect. Yeah, you don't have anything to say, so we can just continue on up this direction and head to the Palace of the Earth Spirits for some fun stuff. There's some very fun stuff going on up here. Uh, I need to switch out my party before we do that, though. <laughs> if you think I'm not going to be a cheap piece of shit, you are out of your mind. Ah, here's my wife. Hello, my wife. Uh, you probably have a lot of fighting types. Some of a fine lead. Huh, it's the first time I've seen a human down here in a long time. You have business further down, right? Then let's have a quick match. If you win, I'll give you the official former hell tour. I'm sure you'll have fun. Now come on, show me what you've got. I'd love a tour from you, Yugi. Just Oni. Not, uh, not anything particular. Not even one of the four Deva. Just Oni. Wonder if we're ever going to meet the fourth Deva. We know three of them now. I, I wouldn't be surprised if the next one comes up in Goyoku Ibun. I've also heard that evidently we're going to meet the, uh, the, the errant, uh, fucking, what's she called? Um, the mysterious final member of the gangs. Like the leader of, I don't know which gang didn't have a leader. It might be the Bird Spirits. Uh, wind. This is an awkward typing for us, to be honest. It's not that awkward, actually. That's uh, perfectly fine for Mayumi now that I think about it, because she's four times warped weak. Um, but yeah, I, I, I hear that allegedly we're going to be meeting the, the last gang leader, which is also exciting, but I really want to meet the final Deva. You also can't rule out the possibility of us meeting another fucking uh, Sage of Gensokyo. Evidently, goddamn Kasen's one of the Sages of Gensokyo. Her Okina and Yukari. I was very surprised to find out that Kasen was a Sage, though. It was not something I expected in any capacity, but it's cool. It is neat. There's a, a neat little bit of, uh, of lore there. God, do I? Yeah, Terida. Um, 
So hopefully we meet another one. I have no clue. Do we even have like a hard number on how many there are? Who knows? It is a mystery. Uh, you're part illusion type, huh? That's a yikes. I only did so much damage because of um, her knocking off a item, I believe. I think. I might be wrong on that, but I'm pretty sure that's how that move works. It's only some of the knockoff moves that work like that, but I think Saint almost fires one of them. Otherwise, there's no reason for that to do so much damage. It's rare to see a human like you defeat Noni like me. You're the one who punished the Liberation Front on the surface, right? How did I know? It's just my intuition. You know that love pop up jar is under. Recently, they've been just doing whatever they want without any regards to anything. Someone needs to punish them. If you want to, you can ask the Master for the Palace of the Earth Spirits for help. I'm going to go get more fucking health because my team kind of took a, took a number there. And, okay, not really my team. Really just Teta, now that I look at it. But Teta is a precious member of our team. She's been quite useful, historically. For a puppet that I didn't really intend to keep for the long haul, she's been uh, she's been quite useful. Same with Mioi, really. I'm, I'm quite happy about the way my team's shaping up. I don't necessarily want to change anyone out. But uh, if we hit a wall, I, I've mentioned it before, but if we do wind up hitting a wall, then that's fine. We will, uh, we will switch someone out, but I doubt that will happen. I think that... Uh, there is some nasty stuff in the late game, in particular. Uh, some of those... There's there's one encounter. There's one... There's... I mean, spoilers. It's the Flandre encounter. is a fucking nightmare, and I hate that fight. Because uh, you have to fight four Flans back to back to back to back. And they all have three puppets and the bullshit cheating AI. And you don't get to heal between them, and it sucks. It is a dog shit fight that I hate with every fiber of my being. And I'm mad that I'm probably going to have to do it again. I feel like it might be partially optional, but I think it's what unlocks reincarnation, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, I just don't want to fuck with it. It's just not fun. It's not a fun fight by any metric. You're the tourney champ, ain't ya? Let's have a battle. Yeah, that's that's very in keeping for Omi. Uh, what do you got? Ooh, me. And you are, uh, unfortunately, part water type, so fucking goodbye. Goodbye forever. Uh, it should be super effective. Oh no, you resist that. You're probably still part Earth then, if I had to guess. Yugi, power Yugi. That is an unfortunate for you, hun. You are gone. Goodbye. Alright, let us continue along. You might have heard a loud bang. I apologize for that. It probably wasn't a gunshot. Probably. As expected of the champion, let's fight again. Uh, I hear a lot of gunshots. I, I do not live in necessarily the best... I mean, my neighborhood, my immediate neighborhood is fine, but... We happen to be quite close to what I can only describe as a PvP zone. And uh, as a result of that, it is uh, it is rare for a week to go by that I don't hear gunshots, to be honest. It's always late at night, and sometimes it's... I mean, sometimes it's people getting shot by one of the nightclubs near my house. Um, that happened recently. Someone, like, opened fire at, like, a furniture store. There was no one in the furniture store, in case you were concerned. But, uh, someone just opened fire at a, at the fucking furniture store, busted up some of the windows, then, uh, pulled up to a nightclub and shot some dudes. Uh, everyone is alive, as far as I recall, but that's just, like, a pretty regular occurrence in the, the immediate area. Like I said, it is a PvP zone. There is always crime taking place there. There is, of course, a 7-Eleven, and 7-Elevens are just, like, de facto PvP zones past, like, 7 p.m. Even before 7 p.m., depending on where they are. You know? That's just how it is. That's that's just the American dream, baby. Constantly being kept up at night by gunshots. That's what we all that's what we all live for, right? Oh, I used the wrong healing item. Whoops. Doesn't matter. Chire sweet buns are, are pretty pretty free at this point in time. I think I mean we can buy them, but they also are the item we're de facto picking up. So I'm not too concerned about wasting them. Uh armor pierce, why not? Shadow bomb? Why shadow bomb? It's not really particularly good, so once again I ask you, why Shadow Bomb though, Tojiko? Again, defense defense uh, Tojiko with her jamming ability, dropping my speed as I leave the battle. It'd be really funny if that applied in the overworld. <laughs> Still impossible to go back. It'd be really funny if I just... <laughs> my bike was really slow now. <laughs> just for a while. Pals of the Earth Spirits is not particularly far away, mercifully. Uh, anything gonna be up here? No, no, come on. Why is this place here? Why is it here? Why do you do this to me, video games? Oh. Oh, got a banger. Ah, yes, the shub. Why does the shoe bill say nothing? Why does it have portrait art? I don't fucking know, but it does. No one's ever gonna take that away. <laughs> look, at, look at that bird. Look, look at the bird. <laughs> caw! Caw! Hell yeah. Fucking say it, brother. You said it. You ain't wrong. When he's right, he's right, you know? Meow. 
Who, who, who this? No one. I, I just keep being... Magatama's... No, I don't think we need to worry about uh, encounters here. Woof, woof, meow, of course. All very important. Eh, eh. Aw, Momio loves me. Isn't that nice? If only I can say that in the real world. Uh, nothing. Nothing else. Let's get going. Those those critters almost block the damn door like the hooligans they are. No, I don't want to go here yet. I want to keep going and uh, hit the bed. Because the bed is the best part of the Palace of the Earth spirits. Here it is, I believe. Yep, here it is. Um, why is there a stranger on my bed? Oh well, scooch over. Nighty night. So we just slept with Koishi. How very Koishi of her. Just if fucking, I'm not gonna tell you to get out of my bed, but at least give me some room, asshole. That's great. It's one of my favorite moments. Speaking of favorite moments, uh, who should I be putting in the party for this particular little fucking bit of clownery? Hmm. Hmm. Does it really matter that much? Probably not. But, uh, I don't have any super low-level catches. Do we just do it? Do we just try it? Let's just try to do it honestly. So you might not know what's going on. This is actually, if you're only familiar with Puppet Dance performance through my original playthrough, somehow, then uh, you might not be familiar with what's about to go down. But they made some changes in Shard of Dreams that were very good. Oh, a visitor. How rare. So your name is Solaire, and Yugi told you to come here. How does she know? You're surprised that I know what you're thinking? I always hear what you're thinking whether I want to or not. Uh, you know how to get to the Underground Geyser Center, right? Or you want to know, but I won't let you through so easily. Now arm your heart and do battle against your own puppets. Yes. So, for this particularly fun little encounter, the, uh, <laughs> Satori uses your own puppets. It owns and also sucks. I hate this encounter. It's tough. Uh, I don't think she uses mind-reading AI, which is very ironic. For some reason... For some reason, she does not use mind-reading AI. I just can't comprehend why. It's like the one time mind-reading AI would make perfect sense, and they don't fucking do it. I, it's such a missed opportunity, but it's also the only reason this encounter is even slightly possible, so I guess you, you take what you can get. Um, sound nature is going to be weak to... You're gonna hit me with a sound-type attack. Do I have anything that even resists sound, though? Like, at all? Saki, maybe? Does Saki resist sound? Yes. Okay, we can put Saki in then. That doesn't hit Dark super effective or nothing. So yes, uh, this is uh, this is a fun little fight. It's a good chance for just a shit ton of experience because this is like the only appropriately leveled encounter in the game simply by virtue of uh, the fact that they're using your own puppets. Oh god, she hits so fucking hard. She's probably gonna kill, huh? Yikes. That's a problem, isn't it? Um... Fuck, I probably should have considered that. Yeah, no, Saki does not stand a chance here, unfortunately. Um, let's see, what is, what is, what is Teda's moveset? Does she have anything she's particularly gonna go for here? Uh, no, I don't imagine so. She'd probably be perfectly fine with... Why wasn't that resisted, by the way? Am I not fucking wind-type? I'm pretty sure that I am, though. Why wasn't that, why wasn't that resisted? Am I stupid? Is sound super effective on dark or something? No? Why does... Why was that not resi- I don't get it. I don't understand. I don't understand. Um, I could put Momoyo in, right? Momoyo... No, Electric is resisted by nature. <laughs> Fuck. Terrida's so annoying. Uh, 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 fucking... Whatever, I'm just putting Momoyo in, man. I don't care. Her stats will figure this problem out. So oh, Momoyo has fucking poison and steel type. What am I talking about? Please don't do half my health. Oh, that's... You didn't... You didn't do half my health! <laughs> that's my fault! Oh, this is a fucking problem, man. I think I might need to just sack somebody. I think I might just need to sack somebody. You're probably gonna go for another Ultra High Tone. Realistically, you should be going for Pollen Mist, because that's what you have the uh, bonus damage on from the... Uh, whatever it's called, but... Yikes! Okay. I needed a clean switch in to either Saki or Momoyo, and I just didn't do that, so that's a problem. Do I just, like, pivot into someone else? Do I try to get cute with it? Because Mioi is going to get hit super effective by sound type, right? Because sound is super effective on illusion. And fighting. And warped. Do I just put my own Terida in and sacrifice her? Who isn't going to be useful in this fight? Like, everyone is still kind of useful. 
I don't know. I need to do something, but I don't know what that something is. This fight's hard. It's it's really, really rough. Especially when you have one team member that kind of just runs your entire team. I mean, I guess I can check their speeds, but I don't see a fucking world in which, uh... Yeah, no. No one outspeeds. Not even fucking close. Literally no one's close. Fuck. This is such a problem. All of my remaining members, it's just Terida. I kind of just need to put her in and sack her to heal someone else up, I think. Unfortunately, that's kind of my only option right now. How much damage will this do? Probably not that much, if I had to guess. Yeah, it is resist to the very least. God. <laughs> do I just behind you? Do I just behind you, maybe? Because she doesn't have anything that's going to do that much damage to me, so I kind of feel like I just go for behind you. Yeah, no, I think that was the play. Because I'm pretty sure Fear drops the uh, focus, or the spread attack. I might be mistaken on that, though. No, it seems like that is the case. Is Heavy Fear a thing? I don't know. I don't really care that much. At this point in time, I'm not super scared anymore. I guess I just go for my own Pollen Mist. No, I go for... Christ. Does it matter, really? I mean, either way, it's resisted, but... I, I want to see whether they have different effects. Ultra High Tone can possibly buff me for a sweep. This has a chance of lowering your spread attack. Uh, I mean, I guess I'd go for the buff, but either way, I don't think it matters too much. She wins the speed tie today, which is good for her. Actually, this is a, a little bit dangerous, isn't it? Give me speed? No dice. Uh, who the fuck do I put in now, though? Like... Does Mioi eat this? Yes, Mioi does eat this, assuming she continues using Eye of Lapis. So I think we put her in, drop her spread attack even further, and Mioi can probably handle it from there. In theory, at least. In execution, who knows? Oh, that did no damage. <laughs> and that's just going to drop your spread attack even further. So, uh, that's good. Ah, uh, Mysterious Wave. Is this resisted, though? No, it isn't. You do outspeed, but you're also, like, minus one spread attack, and also, like, yeah, I'm just not scared of you right now, Tanida. Your your stats have been so utterly gimped by my various decrease effects. That is still a shit ton of damage for someone that's minus one special and also feared, for the record. That is, that is some fucking nuts garbage right there. Yorgamis, uh, Christ, it sure would be nice if I didn't, god damn it. If, if everyone that could handle the Yorgamis wasn't in dire straits right now. Uh, what would you even go... Do you even have anything you can go for? Like, when I think about it... Oh, you probably got lightning speed, don't you, you bastards? That's probably what you're gonna go for, is Blitzkrieg. Speed 142, speed 162. Yeah, you're going for Blitzkrieg, 100%. I mean, in that case, we just switch into Mayumi, don't we? Mayumi is like a good a good wall here no matter what. So yeah, I say we just switch into Yorgami or into to Mayumi here. Would have been nicer if she was going for the fire to, or the fighting type attack, but either way, that's still quite good for us. Uh, I guess we go for a raid. Uh, do we get out speed as Mayumi? I don't actually know. I think we do. I think the Yorgamis are probably faster, but again, it doesn't really matter because you can't do much to me. 162, 163. We actually are slightly faster somehow. Um. Is Waves of Earth neutral or super effective? It is... It is neutral, unfortunately. Uh, so in that case, it doesn't really matter what I go for. I'm gonna go for... Actually, wait. No, Warped is what's... It was super fighting... Why the fuck are you making... God damn it. PC, I fucking muted system sounds. Alright, sorry about that. That is my shitty connection to my controller causing some issues there. I have no clue why it started making noises. I did mute that, but I guess it unmuted at some point. I'm just looking at my type charts. I know that it's uh, not the most scintillating bit of uh, gameplay here, but I just want to make sure. Does warp resist, or does fighting resist? Yes, it does. Okay, so in that case, we definitely do go for Waves of Earth. No no questions. We do have one whole point of speed over them, so we do outspeed, but we didn't quite do... I forgot they had Depressing Rain. It didn't do anything, though, so who cares? I did forget they did have one neutral attack, though. It's, uh, ultimately not that important. What are you gonna put out now? Probably your Mioi? Mayumi, huh? Why, though? But, like, why? For what reason? To what end? 
I mean, because Mayumi's kind of a wall against the rest of my team, I guess, but is she? What are you going to go for here? I don't have anything super effective on myself, do I? Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if she goes for Raid. I mean, if she goes for Raid, then I feel like we just switch into Mioi, right? She's probably going to go for Raid. That's what I do in her situation. So let's hope she does. Yeah! Beautiful. Just the fucking Giga Brain at work there. Uh, on the flip side, that does unfortunately mean that um, it doesn't draw up her good attack stat, which means she still is quite monstrous in that regard. And she also outspeeds, but I think we just go for Aqua Sonic and pray. Uh, we did not pray hard enough. Unfortunately, the prayers have fallen on deaf ears, so that's gonna hurt. That's gonna kill. That's fine, though. We've my Mioi has served her purpose here. We are. I mean, our, we look like we're in a pretty good situation here, but we aren't necessarily. Do I have anyone that can outspeed them left? Uh, yeah, da, Terida. Fucking stupid. Obviously. Obviously, Terida can outspeed. And she should go for whatever gives her the best chance of... Oh, yeah. No, no. I, I guess we go for Ultra High Tone here. Just, like, hope that we get a stat buff of some sort. But... It's not super likely. Either way, all of our attacks are super effective here, so it doesn't really matter too much. Uh, what's next? Saki. Saki, Saki, Saki. Uh, I mean, that is good switching for you, isn't it? We can outspeed. Uh, you are a focus attacker, so behind you isn't going to do much. You're probably going to go for a wind-type attack, which means we just put Mayumi in. And then we go for Twin Gears and pray we don't miss. No, we, we go for the Warped Attack because that can't miss. No, but Dark Resists Warped, so we do go for Twin Gears. Oh, you went for Strike Shot. Even better. Don't know why you would go for Strike. I guess to guaranteed out speed, but... Still isn't necessarily what I would have done in that situation. Should have been what I would have done in that situation, but it isn't. I'm not too much... I'm not, uh... Not going to deny that. Uh, I mean, you kind of just get run at this point. I mean, you probably Aqua Sonic and hit me, but that doesn't kill. We've established. Wait, does that kill? No, that totally does kill, doesn't it? Now that I think about it. It, it didn't quite kill. Uh, if you go for Water type, then I guess we switch into Nobody. You're just going to have to eat this one, huh? I mean, Impulse probably kills, though. Because we're going to outspeed and we'll just kill with your Impulse. Nice! Hey, that was really, really clean. That was a good fight. I'm glad I didn't scum it out. As fun as it is to scum things out, I'm glad that I didn't. Uh, and Saki gets a new skill. That was tough. It's good to face yourself sometimes, isn't it? Now back to the Geyser Center. As you know, the Liberation Front... I read that as fucking Libertarian Front. <laughs> the Libertarian Front has settled there. The way there is simple. Just go straight through here to the remains of Blazing Hell. At the end, you should find the Geyser Center. You can't miss it. I gave you the information. Now go and do what you will. <laughs> The fucking puppet libertarian front. <laughs> oh, God. That's just... My brain, man. It just doesn't work good. All right, let's heal up. Unfortunately, we only get to sleep with Koishi once. No more Koishi sleeping. Uh, is there going to be anything important over here? Okay, there is something over here. No, this is the... No, this isn't quite the way out. The way out is... Uh... This is just, like, an upper area for some reason, I think. I can't ride my bike here either, which is shameful. Let us keep going through the house. Get the Chire Sweet Bun. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. I am a sinner, and I apologize for the harm that I've caused by making shitty, shitty, shitty puns. Uh, meow. Yes, quite. Verily. Oh, thread doesn't really matter. And now we can uh, now we can go ahead and make progress towards the Hell of Blazing Fires, which is just a very cool name for that location. I've always been a fan of the Hell of Blazing Fires. I am also just like a subterranean animism boy, so I'm always biased. But come on, subterranean animism or, or uh, Hell of Blazing Fires is just very dumb, chumi cool. All right, it's just like it's just a bit extra, and that's why I love it. Magic ring. What is the magic ring? Oh, Mioi. I love you, too. I love you enough to call you the wrong thing. Oh, no. Uh, yes. Crit rate go up. That's correct. It is not, uh, it is not the blue necklace or whatever the, uh, spread equivalent is of the red ring. Let's go here. Nothing. Nothing. Hell of Blazing Fire's time. 
That being said, Hell of Blazing Fires is long and my ability to navigate is bad, so I'm going to call it here because it's been about 30 minutes. So this is where it ends. Next time we go through the Hell of Blazing Fires, or as I like to call it, the Hell of Where the Fuck Am I? <laughs> Until then, this has been Solaire, and I hope you have a wonderful day.